Hi everyone, this is Danny for Cami Case Gourmet again. I'm here to show you how to paint the Belle eyes, the Beauty and the Beast princess. She has a very unique eye shape, it's like, like a cat. Um, if you don't know how, about, uh, how to use about the brushes and the paint, you can watch my video about Snow White eyes and then I explain everything. But basically you need like three or four brushes and your figurine and paint. I can use the liquid paint or powder paint, doesn't matter, okay? So I made a heart and I let it dry as a gum paste heart just to make uh, the, the painting for you guys. So we're gonna start using the flat brush, it's this one. This is lower corner, it's American Painter actually, number two, then I like to use it. You always dip a little bit in the water just to make um, the brush start getting very soft and you're gonna get white we start the white and you're gonna make the shape of the eyes there we go. can you guys see it I hope you can see it here we go you let it dry a little and then she has green eyes so you can use the back of your brush to dip in the green light green and to make the little ball her eyes here we go and the same the other side The best is to let the paint dry completely before you start doing the other layer, but I'm making the video, I'm not gonna wait. So after you do that, you're gonna use the black. I'm dipping the bottom of my brush again. I'm just trying to uh, show you guys how to do without buying a bunch of stuff. Um, and you're gonna do the black inside the green. Here we go. And the same to the other side. Let it dry a little. Belle, for who's making her figurine, she has, um, I always make her brown eyelashes because she has brown eyes um, and brown hair. So I use this brush to make details like eyelashes and eyebrows. So I'm gonna deep in the water, take the SX out and use the brown paint. You probably gonna, need to have your figurine to know so the nose will be here and the space between the eyes and the forehead will be here so what you do you just place and push I just need a little bit more place and curve place and curve it's easier when you have the, the figurine so you know exactly where you're gonna be here it looks weird but it's the same way to do it just remember to keep the eyebrows at the same position they cannot be one up here and one down there okay so using the black again and this liner brush you're gonna do the um the contour of her eyes so she has a very catty eyes so you do like this very carefully and you do the other side a little bit Oops. I was looking at the drawing dip too much in the paint here we go and just here you kind of push a little here we go and then the eyelashes. Very, it's better to have less paint than a bunch of paint than you cannot clean off, okay? And the other side, the same thing. So I'm gonna turn around because it's easier. But Doing the same thing to the other side. Okay. 
There's a carry eyes. Here we go. And then the eyelashes. So now we have some details. Then we can have it. For example, if you want to make a detail on her green part of the eyes, you get a darker green with the same liner. And you're going to just do a little circle underneath to give a dip of her eyes. See? You guys can see how different it is already. It's just a little bit, but it's going to give a detail. I'm going to do the same thing to the other side. Here we go. You guys can see it. Then you're going to do um, the little detail, the light of her eyes. I use this brush just to make a little dot, but you can use anything to pick. Anything then is like very tiny to make a little bow. So you dip on the, on the white and between the, bl the black and the gr light green, you're going to do a little dot. That ref is the reflection of the lay on her eyes. Here we go. I hope you guys like it. Um, you can even, when you have your figurine in your hands, give a little details. And on the side of the nose, you can make a little shadow with brown, so the face is going to really take shape. And between the eyebrows and the eyes, you can even do a little shadow too. So it makes like the impression then has all the parts of the face. So I hope you like it. Subscribe us and I'm going to be making more videos in 2013. Um, see you soon. Bye.